Here's poem 4032. Cosmic rays are attacking the Earth. Some 1 times 10 to the minus 26 kilogram particles start at a distance of 3 times 10 to the 13 meters and approach at a speed of 3 times 10 to the 5 meters per second. If we ignore Earth's motion in its orbit, the motion of the Sun, and the motion of the galaxy, the uncertainty in their position when they reach Earth is about... Wow. Well, let's, let's do this. Let's, let's look at point A and point B in the position of these particles. Here's Earth and here's point A and point B. And so these particles are traveling. Um, velocity at A equal to 3 times 10 to the 5 meters per second. And this distance here is 3 times 10 to the 13 meters. So if we say that the, um, the total energy at A is equal to the total energy of B, okay, so the kinetic energy at A plus the potential energy at A, which would be the gravitational potential energy, negative G, m m over radius at a is equal to the kinetic energy of b plus the potential energy of b all right let's multiply or divide through by the mass and solve this for the velocity of b so we will have multiply both sides by 2 take the square root the velocity of b is going to equal the velocity at a squared uh, plus 2g mass of earth 1 over the radius at b minus 1 over the radius at a all that square root I hope this is going somewhere so I got the velocity of b is equal to 3 times 10 to the 5 all that squared plus 2 times 6.67 times 10 to the minus 11 times the mass of the earth which is 6 times 10 to the 24 over it's really just um, 1 over the radius of the earth is going to factor because the other term is going to be too small it's going to be 0 so this is going to be 6.37 times 10 to the 6. All that square root. And I get 3002.09.3 meters per second. All right, so our uncertainty in velocity it's going to be our velocity at B minus our velocity at A, which will be 209.3 meters per second. And since we know the mass of these particles, our uncertainty in momentum is the mass times the uncertainty in velocity, which will be uh, 10 to the minus 26 times this 209. So that's going to be 2.09 times 10 to the minus 24 kilogram meters per second. All right. So our uncertainty in position is going to be equal to h bar over our uncertainty in momentum. 1.055 times 10 to the minus 34 over 2.09 times 10 to the minus 24. And that's going to be equal to 5.05 .05 times 10 to the minus 11 meters. Well, that's what I get. Uh, none of those answers is available. But uh, if you have a, a different way to approach this problem, let me know. Uh, that's my answer, 5.05 .05 times 10 to the minus 11 meters.